What is up, my Moon Tribe? I'm Haley, and welcome back to Moon Tribe Tarot. This is going to be for the star sign of Sagittarius for the month of January 2021. Take what resonates and leave behind what does not. If you'd like to book a personal reading with me, where your messages will 100% correlate to your story, because they are specifically for you in mind, you can find all the information, how to reach me for a reading, in the description box down below. If you like the content that I make and you'd like to support me, please go smash the like and subscribe buttons. Without any further ado, I've already gone and pulled your cards off camera like like always for you Sagittarius. So let's get right into the reading. We got some really good shit this time. We got the Three of Pentacles. We got the Ace of Coins. We got the Queen of Cups. So right off the bat, there's a lot of stable earth energy here representing stability. There's either going to be physical abundance in the form of money or your own stability and abundance prosperous wise. So the Three of the, the three of Pentacles came up first. I almost said Three of Swords. Completely different reading. The Three of Pentacles is a card about working together with your team. Now, because I got this for money, it can either be one of two things. It's either physical abundance in the sense that this is your co-workers working together very closely to make a goal meet, or this is abundance-wise at home in your own personal life. Aside from work, it represents um, emotional abundance. So take this in either one of two ways. This is either going to be, um, I think, it's going to be an emotional spread because we have the queen of cups as the outcome but it could be one of two things it's either going to be that you're working together very hard on your goals um, with people in your work or your family or it's going to be more of a I don't want to say it's more of a relationship thing, but it's more about your abundance. It's about working together on your abundance. So take this how it resonates. I'm just going to read the card as it is. So the Three of Pentacles represents working together in a goal scenario with more than one person. It could be two people. It could be one other person. It could be multiple people. Uh, there are three people indicated here. It represents working together on a goal. And working together hard is going to give you some sort of new abundance or some new sort of physical money. Um, so it's saying that the work that is put out here with your team is going to actually produce something productive. And I really think that it is going to be something that is more emotionally enjoyable than money. I think it's going to be something that gives you physical um, stability and abundance, but not not in a money way. I really think that this is a reading that is saying that you are having a lot in the sense of, st you know, it could be both. It's probably both, actually, because now that I'm thinking about it, um, a lot of people, when they feel stable, they feel stable because they have a good source of out income, they have um, a stable job, they have good abundance coming in, and it makes them feel safe, and that makes them feel secure, and that makes them feel happy. I see this as an overall well-being spread for the month of January. I think that income is going to be good. I think think you have goals that you are going to meet and it's going to be productive and I think it's going to be emotionally responsible in the sense of it's going to be something that gives you a lot of emotions going to make you happy it's going to make you feel full of yourself in a good way it's going to make you feel prosperous now this is not your star sign so it's possible that this could be somebody else coming in um, and making you feel this way it could be a person at work it could be your family it could be a relationship it could also still be you because I really read for the energy more than I do um, the the car so this is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Queen. It could be a man that is an Aries. It really doesn't matter as long as this person is portraying the Queen of Cups. It'd be a more feminine card of somebody that is really good at having a relationship or emotional understanding of how to have relationships. Doesn't have to be committed. It's just she understands how to have relationships. This person understands. Um, they would be a healer. There'd be somebody that is really good at talking to people and expressing um, how they feel to make them feel good. So they'd be a, a tarot reader, a therapist therapist, somebody that's a Reiki healer, a doctor, a nurse, anybody that's in rehab, somebody that heals, somebody that is trying to make you heal. Um, and this is less so that this person is trying to make you heal. I think that this is just a more of an over uh, an abundance of having emotional prosperity because you have um, emotional prosperity coming out. This is an emotional prosperity spread for the month of January. Whatever it is that you've got going on, you've got goals that are being worked on together. It's going to be productive and it's going to make you feel emotionally full. Uh, be this with person or not, it doesn't matter. This is a really good spread for you, Sagittarius. I'm really good. To, I'm really glad to see this here for you. I love you so much, and I'll see you on the flip side. Peace out.